don't want you to think I had any idea what I was getting into yesterday. As far as I was concerned, I was just lending her a van. No, I don't doubt you, love. Uh, hold on. Do you mean a home James van? Um... Well, you could argue that you were doing Sonny a favour. You know, a decluttering the place. But I'm guessing that you didn't whip round with the Hoover before you left. Well, Wendy, you were quite happy to accept the profits from my little raid, weren't you? Oi, dumb and dumber. You better not put Mum's business in any trouble. Who's she calling dumb? Didn't you have a kid when you were about nine? <sighs> Oh, you want to push that one, do you? Listen, there's no harm done. Carly's had a slap on the wrist. Listen, just stay away from me, Jimmy, yeah? Mum's in prison, so, you know, really doesn't need any more aggro. Excuse me, I avoid confrontation at all times. I'm quite open about being spineless when it comes to feisty women. Oh, good. Well, you keep it that way. I'll get a coffee, please, Brenda. Yes. Next time you need a favour, find some other sucker. Well, she soon will find me. You all right? Listen, about what I said before, do you want to just forget about it, yeah? Why don't we just be mates? Seriously? <laughs> no. I'll have my van, though, if it's ready. Uh, yeah, it is ready, if you've got 800 quid. 800 quid? You having a laugh? Well, that's what it costs, parts and labour, so cough it up and you can have your van, or I'm going to keep it. Hmm. What do you think you're doing? Taking my keys, mate. You ain't gonna let you skank me. <laughs> no, you're not. You get where I am. Bob! No, I expected more from you and your mum being banged. Say that again! Don't Come on me! Carly! She's started it, Bob. She's tapped, you know that. Oh, sorry, Dad. I just didn't want Heidi ripping me off. Home, lady! No! Hey. I don't believe this. You just cancelled my call. What? Oh, you know, James accused me of bedding Paddy, and now he's ignoring me. Uh, why? Oh, I'm hoping it's sleep deprivation. And after lambing, I will get my nice, sane boyfriend back. Well, it's all a little bit out of the blue, isn't it? You don't think Emma's been winding him up, do you? Oh, I couldn't give a stuff right now. Anyway, how are you? Great. Right. Oh, well. You ready? Charles has twisted my arm to go to the hotel with her. Yeah, we're gonna have this spa detox thing in me, and then we're gonna hit the bar and retox. Wait, are you sure you don't want to stay in and try and sort this out? What? When he's ignoring my calls, do I look like I'm channeling a doormat? 